Hey guys, what's up? It's Mac, and I am now a year and a half on testosterone. So I haven't made an update video since my one year in testosterone, so it's been a full six months. Changes have been coming slower and slower. The first year, you know, like each month was like, oh my gosh, there's something new every month. But uh, it's been a little bit slower. But there have been some definite noticeable changes in the past six months, so get ready to hear those. You know, today is actually my testosterone shot day. Maybe let's do that really quick because I forgot to do it this morning and... <laughs> One and a half years on testosterone, let's go! So my acne, for sure, is like, worse. It's so hard to see here. Bad for what I've experienced in the past. And the acne on my back, as well, is not too, uh, favorable. So let me show you that. Like here, this acne. And then we got, like, hella acne. Back. Other shoulder, kind of down my arm a little bit. I haven't shaved in about uh, four days, and so I don't know how well you're gonna be able to see it right now, so I'll include some pictures, maybe. My uh, chest hair has like kind of been going crazy this month. I mean, not really, but I mean, like, look at this. Like, I'm not even a fan of it. Like, I'm probably gonna shave it. I ha I normally like trim like my happy trail um, and my armpits I normally trim. I haven't trimmed those in a while. Just for this video in particular because I wanted to have the most hair possible. That's the chest. And then this is the happy trail situation down here. Um, so I'm kind of getting, oh shit, you can't see it very well. I'm kind of getting more hair like all around here and here. The hair on my arms has stayed about the same. My leg hair has gotten a little bit more intense. So over the past six months, I've also been experiencing undesired hair growth on uh, this area of my body. It's weird, I hate it, I shave it. So one thing that I've really loved over the past six months is, you know, before I went on testosterone, my body was like, hourglass shaped and I hated it and I'm still like my hips are still really really big but I'm starting to square out a little bit more because my shoulders are getting wider and my neck is wider um so I look more kind of like straight up and down ish I mean you can tell that my hips are you know bigger than I would like but um my ass is bigger than I would like but uh all in all I'm more you know, masculine shaped ish. So also over the past six months, I have not been making use of my gym membership. Who would have guessed? But I still feel like, you know, I'm slightly ish muscular, like more muscular than I was maybe. I don't know, like And so you gain weight typically when you go on testosterone. And I had gained, I went from 145 pounds being, you know, five foot nine inches tall, which is pretty skinny. Um, and I went to 165. And now I weigh about 160, so I've lost about five pounds. I think it's mostly because I have been eating healthier. One of my favorite changes from testosterone besides the drop in my period, which I haven't had a period since I was four months on testosterone, I call it shark week. Um, my other favorite change is having uh, the change of my face shape, just because my face shape before was so feminine. Uh, I don't wanna mess up my hair. My hairline was like really curvy, like so my hair went down to here. Now it's a lot more like square, you know? But my face is just like a lot more square. Um, my jaw is kind of sharper, my chin is sharper. Um, so it just, it looks like more masculine. Like I look older. I mean, I still look like I'm 15 years old, but I don't look like I'm 12 years old anymore, so that's a plus. My eyebrows continue to get thicker. Those are pretty crazy. Mood-wise, I have noticed that I haven't been as irritable, I think, the past, like, six months. Like, I feel like I've evened out even more in my emotions, because, you know, when I first went on testosterone, I was very irritable. Things people said really got on my nerves, and I'm still kind of like that. Um, just, you know, but not as bad. I don't, I'm not as quick to anger as I was before. One really interesting thing is when you go on testosterone, you hear from almost everyone that like your ability to cry goes away, which is fine by me because I hate crying. Before I went on testosterone, I would cry a lot and I, you know, cried a couple times. When I, the last time I 
ever cried on testosterone was two months. I remember exactly the occasion it was, but I hadn't cried for like a year. And maybe around like three months ago or something, I was like just watching some like dramatic sad movie and all of a sudden I'm like, I'm leaking, oh my god, what's coming from my eye sockets? I don't understand. And it was just like some like dramatic sad movie. And I was crying, I'm like, what the f what? There's something that I've only mentioned on my channel, I think once, and it's very interesting. People ask about it a lot, but when you go on testosterone, it's really gross, but a known fact that your downstairs junk area uh, grows a little bit, like a couple inches. And um, when you're maybe like three or four months on testosterone, three or four, I think is probably when I said I was having like, it was like just, it kind of hurt. Like it would just like, you'd be sitting there and like you'd move the like wrong way and you'd be like, oh, that, that kind of hurts, that's uncomfortable. And so that kind of started happening like uh, a couple of months ago again, is like I would just like, you know, shift my pants or something. I'd be like, ooh, ah, mm, that's, yikes, that's not pleasant, that, ow. So it's just really like sensitive. It had, it's gone away about the past month, but for a while, like maybe a month, it was like, it was just really weird, it was uncomfortable. So, <laughs> gross. Right now it's August, and so the past three months or so it's been like really, really hot, um, cause it's the summer. And I've noticed that I've been like sweating a lot more than I used to, cause I don't remember pre-testosterone really being like a sweater. Like, I didn't sweat that much. And so now I'm like outside and I'm drenched in sweat and I'm like in the same climate I have been in for many, many, many years. And it's like, I'm just very confused. And I guess it's because of testosterone. It's like you sweat more, you smell worse, so like you have to shower like 20 times a day, no big deal. I mentioned this in every, I think, testosterone update video is I had been very, very tired. But the past six months, I haven't been as tired. Like I'm still only getting like, you know, maybe six hours of sleep, which I should probably be getting eight, um, but I go to bed too late. And I feel just like not as tired throughout the day. Ugh, I really hope I'm not leaving anything out. Um, if I do, ask me about it in the comments or something. But the last uh, change that I can think of is my voice. Let's see if my voice is dropped. Mm, okay, ah, mm. Hi, my name is Mac, and this is my voice pre-testosterone. And this is my voice two weeks on testosterone. And this is my voice one month on testosterone. And this is my voice two months on testosterone. And this is my voice three months on testosterone. And this is my voice four months on testosterone. And this is my voice five months on testosterone. And this is my voice six months on testosterone. And this is my voice seven months on testosterone. And this is my voice eight months on testosterone. And this is my voice nine months on testosterone. And this is my voice ten months on testosterone. And this is my voice eleven months on testosterone. And this is my voice one year on testosterone. And this is my voice a year and a half on testosterone. So yes, this is me a year and a half on testosterone. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, comment down below. Share this video on my channel with your friends. If you haven't followed me on social media, what are you doing? The links are in the description. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.